I guess it was mentioned somewhere that fingers have landed uh, in somewhere where Marika found them and then she be it was chosen to be a god or something. This would make sense with this. It also looks like the uh, white lightning from the meteoric whatever play. Oh, that's an elf, I think.
fuck's sake. One of the glintstone sorceries that manipulates gravi gravitational forces, fires on a gravita gravitational projectile that pulls enemies before finally exploding. Said to have originated in the lightless dark beyond, the home of the falling star beasts. Are they sleeping? Wait a minute. What? They were alive. Uh, dead then. Okay, interesting. Okay, is it my is my brain playing pranks on me? They, the hands, the finger creepers, never had a sound of that. They were just mute. And now I can finally understand them or something. Is it because we're near another finger forest? It's the only idea I have. But... Oh, that's, that's a lot of nuts. nuts. For a moment I thought it was a boss or something. <laughs> can go back to Ymir. Hmm. The earth tree seed of this talisman was presumed to be an object of myth. This age-old artifact also depicts the two fingers, perhaps harking back to the birth of the earth tree. <coughs> sure remains on it. Devoted to its summoner, the Siang diminut diminut diminutive finger creeper eagerly restores HP. They are also ever f they are ever so fond of their mothers at this tender age. <laughs> Hello there. I heard another sound, colored by your essence. <laughs> Simply exhilarating, I must say. The stars are dark tonight. But rest assured, this is no ill omen. On the contrary, I believe that this portends a magnificent starry cascade. Now, take this. My final gift to you. May you join the glimmering stars above. Oh yes. I believe I can feel it brewing. This evening is a sign of a greater night to come. A finger sorcery of Count Emir, High Priest, one of the secret hallowed rites. Conjures an image of a microcosm at the foe's feet that pulses with a single wave before disappearing in a burst. The broken, discarded are fully willing to cling to fleeting simulacra, earning them some modicum of sympathy. Do you recall what I said? That Marika and the fingers that guided her were unsound from the start? Well, the truth lies deeper still. It is their mother who is damaged and unhinged. The fingers are but unripe children. Victims in their own right. 
We all need a mother, do we not? A new mother. A true mother who will not give birth to further malady. That's concerning. Join the glimmering stars above. I told you once, I've no interest in companionship. But I must admit, Count Emir did seem very pleased. Perhaps an exception is in order. Emir is a shining star in our eyes. The only star upon the black canvas of the night. Our meeting with the Count taught us of the star-draped sky. We know that we cannot reach out to touch it, but we can peer up at its brilliance and heed its guidance. We will never again lose our way in the night. I have spoken far too freely. Pay me no mind. Let us focus on our shared purpose, our service to Count Emir. Now, be on your way. A simple map faded and dirty acquired from Count Emir High Priest indicates a third and final hallowed ruin distinct from those shown on the first two maps. Um, but this is here. He's not here, but I can examine, so... Oh! Okay. At least explains the fucking map. Snake. Oh! Fuck. Hand of Night Anna. Oh, is this? Oh, chill, buddy. Close of bottomless black from which no light can escape, wielded by Anna, sword under night, engraved with smith script, enabling strong attack to launch off all the three clans at target. The blades are only semi corporeal and cannot be fully guarded against. Hmm. Like the usual katana that you get in every Souls games from someone that's invisible and bypasses shields. That's actually good. Well, there is a lot of them. Holy shit. And they fly quite far. I like it. So I assume this is a boss. This is where all the fingers come from. And they're empty inside, like fucking... Ah, uh, disgusting. But I assume that this is the boss. <laughs> That's ugly.
Pow! Holy shit! That was crazy. I really expected that. 